Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, we're going to go ahead and check out Caro's host. He did create a light version of the jailbreak, so I thought we'd go ahead and check it out and see how well it works. We'll go over to our settings. I will show you that I don't have the goal 10 options as well as I don't have debug settings. So we'll go up to our network and go ahead and check connect to the internet. And then we'll go ahead and back out of there. We'll go ahead and launch our browser. Then we'll just do the usual, close that first window, delete all, go into our browser history, clear that as well. And then we'll go into our settings and delete our cookies and clear our website data. Now we'll go into our bookmarks and we'll go ahead and select Caro's host. It's just the main host. And over to the right you will see the 900L. I know some people have been asking what the difference is with all these. Uh, 900 gold is it uses the bin loader server so it's a lot quicker when you go ahead and launch payloads uh, 900N does the jailbreak each time before it loads the payloads and 900NA is an auto goal 10 loader and then it's the same as the 900N where it does the jailbreak each time it loads the payloads and then 900L is the light version and it just has the goal 10 with a couple payloads. Um, it, it is an auto jailbreak so we'll go ahead and select it and we'll give it a few moments here to install the cache. It does go pretty quick as there's not many payloads. Okay so there's 50 percent. Okay 70 percent, 75 percent. There we go page cache successfully. So we can go ahead and hit our PlayStation button uh, you don't need to disconnect from the internet, but for the video, I'm going to go ahead and show you that it is available without being connected to the internet. So we'll go ahead and uncheck connect to the internet and back out and launch our browser. So it is doing an auto jailbreak here, and it will auto load goal 10. Uh, we'll just wait for the message to pop up to insert our USB. Shouldn't take too long between 10 and 30 seconds. Okay, so we'll go ahead and insert our USB. Give it a few moments to pop up with unsupported file system. And there we go. So we'll go ahead and hit OK. Jailbreak done. Please remove the USB. So we'll go ahead and unplug our USB. And then we'll go ahead and hit OK. Now that the jailbreak is done, we can go ahead and launch the Goal 10 2.0 B2. And as you can see, it does load with no issues. Now from there, we can go ahead and select any other payload that we want to use. If we want to go ahead and use Orbis's toolbox, we can go ahead and select it. And as you can see, Orbis's toolbox loaded with no issues. Um, as for other payloads, you can go ahead and dump your games if you're backing up some games, disable updates, enable updates, uh, app to USB, your bin loader's there, mirror's there. We can go ahead and select disable updates. It's a great one to have. It creates a dummy file in your PS4 update folder and just kind of blocks that update from coming. So go ahead and select it and as you can see it is disabled now. So we'll go ahead and hit our PlayStation button. You can see that Orbis's toolbox does come up. Go into our settings. We have our goal 10 options as well as our Orbis's toolbox. Now for our Orbis's toolbox, I like to have settings. Um, I usually just check everything here. I uh, don't check those. And then I go into the game overlay. Basically, it just brings up everything when I'm playing a game. So I put that over on the right side and just go ahead and check everything. And the good thing about Orbis's toolbox, you can load your or save your settings. So that way, each time you load Orbis's toolbox, everything will come up um, as long as you have load configuration on startup. But yeah, guys, that's basically it for the video. Uh, I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. really helps out the channel. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.